Hi, 7A and or students who are stuck at home from 7B and 7C. So 7A, you're the only class that has lesson 17 at home. It would have been nice to do this in person. I booked computers for 7B and 7C so that I can look over kids' shoulders and see if they're doing, if they're kind of on track. Um, so I would have loved to help you more in person, but we'll hopefully have time for that next week. Um, all you're doing is working on your play. So you already saw these two videos, but if you need a reminder, this is these are the YouTube links. You saw them on Edpuzzle, but YouTube links, so you can actually fast forward if you need. Or you could just click on the example, which is the example I give in the video. The male nurse. Now, I, I realized that I actually, in the video, there's one thing I did wrong that I corrected later. And that is, if you go to the end of any scene, come on, work with me here. It's frozen. Hello. There we go. Act one, scene one. A little bit of a setting, what you see at the rise of the curtain, blah, blah, blah. At the end of every scene, why is this so slow? You hit tab five times and then write blackout. And then enter, enter again, tab five times, all caps, end of scene. The reason you write blackout is because that means the lights turn off. And then your director and your actors know that it's the end of that scene. Then act two, scene one, scene two, scene three, same thing. Blackout, end of scene. Also at the end of your play, blackout, end of scene, even though it's the end of the play. Anything else I need to tell you? I don't think so. Just work time. Attendance part two will just be to keep working on your play because I can see how much you've done on Google Classroom. So make sure that you've at least created a Google Doc in Google Classroom play manuscript so I can see how much you've done. Questions? Call me, email me, slash contact me via telepathy.